Hey everyone, and welcome back to more Tales of Zillia 2. I am in a much better mood than last time, and so now is obviously the best time. I was doing these missions, but they're stupid, so I'm abandoning them. It's really annoying because all of the wrong enemies show up. Like, everything but those enemies were the ones showing up. Anyways, uh, the Unicorn Horn, I think I mentioned this before, but we have to get that from the EX Dungeon. We'll be doing that later. What we're going to do today is first... Guess what? Hi, Luger! It's about your loan payment, right? Why else would I call you? But anyways, let's pay off the last of the loan! 100? No. Not 100. 2 mil. There. Done. Oh, it switches it back to where I have to pay back- I can't pay back the last 100? That's dumb. Wait a minute. It's probably got a cutscene or something. Yeah. You really gave till it hurt, huh, Luger? Let me collect your last 100 gold personally. I'll be waiting in front of Spurious Core. Okay. And we also have stuff at the mailbox, so uh, let's go to Spirius first, and then we'll go and pick up all the items we've got stocked up at the, uh, whatchamacallit, near Spirius. We'll pick up all the items we got at Luger's uh, mailbox afterwards. There's like no music. Oh, uh, there it goes. Okay, good. She's right over here. Vera is here too. Interesting. Time to pay off this last hundred gold. Finally be done. Wow, you really did it. You paid off the 20 million gold debt. I can't believe it. Finally. I I think I'm going to cry. Oh, and Luger, I want to give you something to celebrate going out of debt. How about going to a hot spring with me? Huh? Uh, that's not going to fly. I already saw his uh, future bride. She looks a lot like Elle. It ain't you. Now, just a minute, Nova. You said you were taking me to that hot spring. <laughs> Was this whole thing intended to be a gift to Luger from the start? Uh-huh, and you're coming too. We're gonna have a blast. This sort of thing calls for a huge celebration. Everybody's coming. The more the merrier. Yeah, that sounds really merry, all right. Hey, congratulations, Luger. Wait a minute, who said that? Ah, cool, everyone's here. All my friends that are always with me. I heard you got your debt paid off. What great timing. I was just about to call everyone together. We're all going to have a big party to celebrate Luger getting out of debt. I'm taking everyone to the cel Celestial Hot Springs? Yeah, Celestial. That's what that word is. Pets and dolls are welcome too. Are you guys excited? A hot spring trip at a time like this? Why not? On second thought, it's not a bad idea. It could be very beneficial to restore one's energy and wash away the aches and pains of battle. That's true, and Luger deserves a little reward for his hard work. Meow. Um, Luger, I've never actually been to a hot spring before. So let me get this straight. Hot water just keeps flowing out of the ground? How have we not done this sooner? Perhaps I'll use this opportunity to teach you the proper way a man washes one's back, Luger. Definitely need to know how to do that properly. And I'll bring everything we need for some pillow fights in truth or dare. This is turning into a fan fiction. I think Luger- I think Luger here is more excited about the prospect- Prospect? I can't read. Of co-ed bathing, isn't that right? This is turning into a fan fiction. N no. Ah, this must be one of those naked bonding experiences which people always speak of. Who talks about naked bonding experiences? Very well then, I will partake in the hot spring experience with everyone. Let us engage in naked merriment and become better companions. <laughs> well put, well put. Seems like a rather brazen way of putting it though. Hey, this is a party. I say go brazen or go home. <laughs> you hear that, Luger? All right, gang, let's go put the hot and hot springs. <laughs> what is happening? You get an awesome anime cutscene? Sweet. Totally worth the 20 million gold. Oh, what? Oh my goodness, Zillia, what are you doing? <sighs> so this is a natural hot spring. <sighs> my back really needed this. <sighs> Vera, you sound like an old woman. <laughs> I have to say, this is the life, isn't it? We have to come back sometime, and bring Elle with us, too. Yes, absolutely. By 
by the way. How's the water on your side, boys? <laughs> no complaints over here. Let us out! It's supposed to be a co-ed bath! <laughs> Alvin, stop pushing! <laughs> to think I once commanded the Rajagol army. Oh. Hey, I think I found the zipper! Ah, that is not a zipper, uh, take it sorry easy! Sorry about that, guys! Uh, huh? What's up with the towels? Huh? <laughs> They're being digested! <laughs> we might be close friends, all, but not nearly close enough for a cool like that. Everyone, let's cheer for Luger! For paying off his loan! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Thank you for playing Tales of Zillia 2. That was great. That's the kind of uh, extra ending you give someone. Oh, do we get some awesome fan art? Well, it's probably not fan art, but I mean like extra art or whatever. I always say fan art when I see pictures like this. A life without decision would be so easy, but such a bore, don't you think? True, free will is definitely a really awesome thing. A great cook and good around the house. Luger's going to make a great husband. Totally. Congratulations on completing the game. We hope you enjoyed the journey along the way. I did. There were some moments where it was kind of iffy, but I really did enjoy this game. We're still not done. We still got stuff to do. If you're reading this, then you've cleared the game, but there's still much to be done, so keep on playing. I'll keep on playing, Fujishima-sama. San, senpai. The world of Zillia is a place of darkness, but one that provided much warmth. Bleh, can't read. This is really cool. The music comp composer, he's done pretty good. The song that Julius and Luger hummed was not only the main theme of the title, but the one that carried the most sentimental value for me. It was a very nice theme. Tales of Development Team. Are they done with the uh, quotes? I was liking the quotes. Anyways, I'm going to let these credits roll. I don't know if these are the credits that rolled the last time or not. I know I didn't read those uh, quotes before. But anyways, man, that was, a, that was pretty funny. I wasn't expecting that. Four guys go into one giant doll, all of them wearing a towel, <laughs> only a towel, that begins to disintegrate. Five guys, not four, five. I forgot, uh, I forgot, uh, Rowan for a second. That was just cruel. Like, they couldn't have taken turns in the bath, like, girls first, and then they finish, and then guys go. That was just cruel. Of course, you know, Zillia would have to throw in some random girl bathing scene at the end. They couldn't let the game end without that as most anime and manga and everything else tend to do, you gotta get that one, at least one girl bathing scene. With either just one, like the hottest girl or the majority of them. That's how it always goes. Here are the model designers and all. I've already done my review on the game, uh, so I'm, I really have nothing to say here. I've already said all I think about the, pretty much all I think about the game. It had its moments where it was a little kind of iffy. I think mostly that was me not doing the jobs, though. But at the same time, I don't like it if the game kind of makes you... You have to do these side missions or you're not going to be strong enough to take on the main stuff. Which kind of makes sense, but at the same time, if I don't want to do the side stuff, if I just want to go through the main game, I want to be able to go through the main game without being completely screwed over. But at the same time, once again, you know... If they have side stuff and you don't, they don't include that as in, like, this is what you get to the level, then if you do the side stuff, you'll end up being too strong for the main stuff and you'll just have no fun with the game because you'll be overpowered. So, I can see both sides of the story. I think that definitely if I had done a few more of the side jobs early on in the, in the game, I wouldn't have had as much problem. But there are still moments where, like, Volt, Volt is the one that I always go to. He was stupid. And the amount of enemies that go underground was just ridiculous. But... This game was definitely very good. I wish they would have had more art than this to show us, but this is also very nice. Oh, cool. We got uh, more whatchamacallits. Here's to hoping that the world of Zillia has left a lasting impression that you can look back fondly on for years to come. It most certainly has on buki san Thank you. Baba-san here is going to tell us something. Life wouldn't be without its share of tough decisions. Please take a moment to empathize with Luger in the aftermath of his journey. 
These are some very nice quotes. I wish all games did this. Have like the some of the most important people on the team leave some cool quotes like that. That's very nice. That is a very nice touch. Is that it? We done? And like, yeah, I press X and then it fades out. That was great. I liked that. Especially that last cutscene. That was good too. Finn! I think this is the second time I've gotten to see the screen. We're gonna get to see it one more time too. At least one more time. I don't know if it says it again at the end of the uh, EX dungeon. Do I get to save? Event list updated. Consumed 100 gold. Earn title perfect body. There you go. You paid off all your debt. Your data will be saved. When you load your saved data, you will be able to continue from before when you last talked to Nova. I got the perfect body trophy. Nice. Not the debt repaid or like 20 millionaire trophy or anything. The perfect body trophy. Which makes sense because, you know, that last cutscene and all. That was very nice. I'm glad I paid off all the debt and that I recorded doing it. We're not going to listen to the uh, opening theme. We are going to get to listen to that one more time. I mean, you can always go back and watch it or look it up if you really want to hear it. But uh, when I beat the game for the last time, after we do the X dungeon, you get a, a secret ending, I think. The, like, one true ending. So I'm going to have to beat Bacor and all of them again. And after I do that to finish the series, we're going to listen to it one more time. Why do you still... Wait a minute. I can't press L2. Why do you still have the exclamation point? Is it going to make me go through all that again? All right. I had to uh, cut out a little part there because, you know, the thing happened where it made me redo it all again. I talked, I don't know how much I'm going to cut out from that, but basically I talked, in case I cut out the part where I talked to Nova, I talked to Nova, and when I talked to Nova, it uh, redid the entire scene again, and I couldn't skip through the credits, so I'm just going to snip that out in editing real quick. Nothing was missed, I promise you, it was just the exact same thing again. So we don't have to worry about that now, thankfully. Let's go on in here and get all of our items. That we've earned from paying off this debt. The Royal Feast times three. Nice. Uh, five more friendship potions. We're about to use those. Uh, share the wealth. No jacket for Jude. No jacket for Mila. Oh, that was all? Really? So my debt is completely repaid now. Ah. Feels good to be out of debt. It feels good. Anyways, uh, let's see what Jude and Mila look like without their jackets on. Because I think they're the last people. They have to be because I can't unlock any more. Anyways. Uh, no jacket for Jude. No, about what I expected. Uh, go back into your... Let's put you in your Zillia 1 outfit. Yeah, that's fine. And then Mila without jacket. Yeah, that's... That's... Mm-hmm. That's roughly what I expected to get out of Mila with no jacket. That's roughly what I was expecting. Let's put you back to your normal white outfit. Anyways. That totally... That no jacket Mila totally fit with the uh, last cutscene we got. If you talk to, I guess that this exclamation, that's going to get on my nerves. I'm OCD, sort of. I can't stand that one little green exclamation point always being there. Because if I try to talk to, uh, what's your face to get it to go away? If I try to talk to Nova to get it to go away, it just, uh, does the whole thing over again. And it, I don't think it goes away. No, it doesn't. So that's stupid. I don't like that. But whatever. It does make a big deal. It's not a big deal. Uh, where did I need to go? Where did I need to go? Oh, I wanted to go to Fenmont. And buy some more stuff. Buy some more items. And we also need to give everyone friendship potions. Mainly Gaius and Musée so that I can take them into the AX dungeon later. Let's break out these uh, friendship potions. Elise is maxed out. So let's, uh, let's go until Gaius is maxed out. Holy cow, that's three and still not maxed. Come on. How many of these do I have to give you, Gaius? I thought we were cool. Give a bunch of them to Musée. Give some more of them to Gaius then? Okay. Oh my goodness, we're never going to be best friends. Do these even work? How many of these friendship potions do I have to give these people? Come on. Is it not going to tell me if they're maxed out friendship or not until after I exit out and come back? Well, I'm all out now, so who cares? I just totally raised the crap out of our affinity, though. Hey, guess what? I shed my wings and grow a new set every season. <laughs> But don't tell anyone else, okay? I'm serious. I was contemplating your existence and what it means to me. That's that's something cool to be contemplating, Gaius. You know, my entire existence and what the point of me is. I am Gaius and I am Erston. I have two faces and two identities. 
But whatever my guise, be it commoner or king, I feel that you are somehow able to bring out the true me. You are not my enemy, nor my subordinate. It pleases me to consider you my friend. Perhaps I have said too much, or perhaps there is nothing wrong with saying this sort of thing from time to time. Gaius is too wise. Did you just give me a title, Muse suitor? <laughs> that ride is reserved for Gaius. 